What is going on, fellow farmers? Welcome back to another Beginner's Guide Tour with your boy CG Farms right here on FS22. Today, guys, we're going to be talking about the seeds faction that they just brought to FS22 not too long ago. Um, subscribe if you're new. Smash that like button for me. Click that bell and click off so you know exactly when I post new content and when I go live. And if you want to get your hands on some amazing and awesome giant software gear and you want to help out CJ Farms, uh, the CJ Farms YouTube channel in the process, please be sure to check out the links below with the blue diamonds beside it as you will really, really help me out and get your hands on some awesome giant software gear in the process. That being said, let's get on with the video. What is going on fellow farmers welcome back to another beginner's guide tour with your boy cj farms right here on fs22 today guys it's gonna be part 26 of these tutorials today we're gonna be talking about the seed factory uh subscribe to the channel if you haven't already smash that like button for me click that bell and click off so you know exactly when i post new content and when i go live ladies and gentlemen let's get on with this so the first thing we need to do is we need to find this seed factory uh, now if you go into your store and go down to construction uh, so I go to other and then go to construction and if you go into buildings I'm sorry production go to production then go to factories and then scroll all the way down you're gonna find the seed production right here ladies and gentlemen there it is right there uh, it costs forty five thousand dollars and as you can see there is a certain amount of input that you need to have an output so if you when you click on these factories if you will look the arrow pointing down indicates the input that you need. The, the arrow pointing out indicates what you get from the input. So, for example, here, if you put in trees, out comes wood chips and um, wood planks, okay? For the seed factory, if you input these types right here, you'll get seeds from it. So, uh, so um, wheat, corn, I believe it's wheat, corn, barley, oats, and sorghum is what we're going to get. So, grab that, guys. Put it down somewhere. And then once you get it, guys, you're going to see these little icons, and we're going to walk up this little gear, and we're going to push the R. And in here, uh, you will see that these are the ingredients, which says recipe. So you are going to have to have these ingredients right here, which is wheat, barley, oats, corn, and sorghum to produce seeds. Once you have all the ingredients in there, also make sure before you put anything in or after, make sure you click activate right here, and make sure you have the little white dot. Once it, when it's deactivated, there will be no dot there if you click activate you will then have a dot right there okay it is now uh red but it's that's because it says materials missing okay so we had to put it in the proper materials go ahead next out of this and let's head over to our tractors here as we do have the ingredients right over here let me hop in here now this is going to be our wheat this is going to be our wheat in this one i believe this is our wheat yeah so we're just going to pull up right here as you can see, guys, uh, your outtake is right there where that pipe is. That is your outtake. We're going to pull up right here, and we're just going to dump this off into here. There we go. Pull up until the uh, until it prompts you there. I know it's been a while, guys. I've done it to almost start doing more here. Uh, and we've been on No Man's Land as well, so I hope you guys are enjoying those episodes. All right, there we go. And there goes... Ooh, 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 ooh. thought that was going to... Good thing that was transparent. So there goes our wheat. So we're going to put in our wheat here. I do have the help went on for you guys so y'all can see what's going on here at all times. And next up is going to be our oats. Or, I'm sorry, our barley. Our barley oats is next. So we're now going to put in our... Whoa, slow down there, CJ. We're going to now put in our oats. I mean our barley. I'm so sorry. I don't know why I keep saying oats. Barley. B A R L E Y barley. <laughs> barley. We're gonna put our barley right there. All right, guys. So I'm gonna go ahead. As you guys see, we, we know what all the ingredients are. I'm gonna go ahead and put all these ingredients in here, and then I'll bring you guys back into the video. All right, guys. So if you will now look as we are pouring our sorghum, our last ingredient here. If you're looking to that little menu right here, which you can go into your uh, pause menu, 
and then go down to this little symbol right here for production chains, you will see that everything is uh, well filling up. We got 12,099 liters of wheat, barley, oats, corn, and sorghum. So now what we have to do is you can see we have now two liters of seeds. So here's what we're gonna do. Now, the longer you wait, the, the more that those seeds are gonna fill up, okay? So we're gonna pull off. And like I said, guys, make sure that your factory is activated, okay? Make sure it's activated. Now, we'll go back over here. Now, you can do this either way. You can go into the pause menu or you can go to this little gear and click on it like that. It's now got five liters of seeds. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to back up and I'm going to speed time up just a little bit. We're going to go around today. All right, and now we should have more seeds in there. All right, so seven liters. So it's going to take a while to get these seeds up and going. But as you guys can see, that's pretty much how it works. Uh, let me go ahead and keep this thing going here. Let's go ahead and go around, go around, go around. Now, let me go back into the menu. Now, if you put more um, wheat, barley, oats, corn, and sorghum in there, you will obviously get more seeds, right? So here is your ingredients, the amount of your ingredients that you need, uh, which I believe is 20,000 liters. I think that's 20,000 liters of your wheat, barley, oats, um, corn and sorghum. Uh, so if you put 20,000 liters, I think what it is of each one of those in there, you get 100% seeds. Now, if I grab, um, if I grab, I'm, I'm pretty sure uh, that this trailer holds seeds. If I take this trailer back around, I'm just going to show you guys here real quick. We're going to go back around to the factory here. And if I go to this factory right here, uh, the only factory we have, duh. And I pull up under that pipe, all right, and I click start filling. You will then, uh, you can fill with wheat or you can do the seeds. Obviously, you want the seeds. Uh, you have 15 liters of seeds, and that's pretty much all we got from that. But, again, guys, it, it takes time. In time, um, your seeds will build up, and you will eventually have more seeds in there. Now, um, I don't know if I can take those 15 liters of seeds and put it back in there. That wasn't a lot at all. Let me let me pull back up here and see if I can't put those. So yeah, I can dump the seeds right back into the um, into the factory there. And I think that's pretty much it, guys. I don't think there's anything else I need to show you. Um, as far as that goes, um, and the seeds building up, it again. See, and they just keep going up. It's just going to take time um, for them to produce in there. Um, and if you have dash time or something like that, you can speed the time to make the process a lot quicker. As you can see, it's going up about one liter, uh, well, two or three liters every 24 hours. So we'll go around one more time. We'll go around one more time here. There we go. And again, it's still going up. But again, guys, you can fill these all the way to the top if you want to. Uh, and I can show you an easier way to do it. If you have a, um, if you have a mod called Power Tools, which you can find in the mod hub uh, for um, uh, of your um, FS22. Um, you can click your power tools with a trailer on. Just make sure that when you do this, your trailer is selected. You open up the power tools, guys. Go to fill vehicle, uh, and then click on it again where it says done empty. Um, let's do it again. Sorry, guys. Hit your power tools. Go to fill vehicle, and then you want to go over and you just want the regular ingredients like wheat. We'll grab wheat, right? So I would grab this wheat. I would take it over there and I would just dump it into that spot right there. Pretty much is, uh, I'm going to empty that real quick. That's pretty much how it works. Um, and like I said, guys, with the seeds building up, it just takes time and more ingredients. So that is going to do it, guys, for this tutorial. Um, subscribe if you're new. Smash that like button for me. Click that bell and click all so you know exactly when I post new content and when I go live. Uh, guys and girls, also, if you want to get your hands on some amazing and awesome giant software, be sure to check out the links in the description with the blue diamonds beside it as you will get your hands on some amazing giant software gear and you will also help support the CJ Farms YouTube channel. With that being said, until next time, guys and girls, stay safe, stay awesome, and be humble. I will see you all in the next video.